Wow, I can't believe Donald did that for him. In 2018, President Donald Trump made a promise to 94 year old Sergeant Alan Jones. Our commander in chief had invited the World War II veteran up on stage during a Kansas City Veterans of Foreign Wars event. That was a tremendous honor in and of itself. But Mr. Jones, the 2015 16 VFW chief of staff, had a question for Trump. I'm going to be 95 years of age on April 11th of next year. Hopefully, you will allow me to bring my family into the Oval Office to meet you. Now, the president's respect and appreciation for this nation's heroes is well documented. Trump loves our military veterans, so do you really think he could refuse such a request? Of course he couldn't. Trump quickly agreed to make this veteran's dream come true and swore he'd make it happen. Well, presidents are busy people, and other presidents might have forgotten about such a promise. After all, Trump has the weight of the country, and often the entire world, on his shoulders, so nobody would blame him if his promise disappeared under that weight. But Donald Trump did not forget, and it's worth seeing. Last Thursday, he made good on his word and invited Jones, along with three other World War II vets, to the Oval Office. And yes, Trump timed it so the visit would land on Jones' 95th birthday, just like he requested. Trump tossed up a tweet citing the happy event and included a video of his initial interaction with Jones. Beautiful afternoon in the Oval Office today with a few great American heroes. Beautiful afternoon in the Oval Office today with a few great American heroes. Joining Jones and Trump at the White House were Floyd Wigfield, Sidney Walton, and Paul Kreiner, each of whom are over 100 years old. Wigfield, 101, wanted to see Air Force One. And once again, Trump just couldn't say no to a national hero. We'll work that out, he said. You'll like Air Force One. During their visit, Trump said how much he appreciated their service and said they were great heroes, great warriors, and highly respected. This is how a true leader behaves, America.He thanks and honors those who serve their country, and he certainly doesn't forget any promise he makes to them. Trump is a patriot and role model for youngsters across the nation. We should all follow his example when it comes to veteran appreciation.